I can't wait to get to the Big Top Circus! Hot ziggity! This is going to be great! Hold on to that ticket, Pep! We don't want to lose it! Okay, we've got a long drive to the circus. We better get going. Apple Valley, here we come. Hey, it's a goat. He sure is cute. <laughs> flowers might come in handy. I think I'll hold on to them. <laughs> Here, goaty goaty. Here, goat. That did the trick. Well, yeah, thanks, partner. Say, I don't believe we've met. The name's Cassidy. Roll along, Cassidy. Glad to meet you. I'm Putt-Putt. Well, howdy, Putt-Putt. I've been trying to get that gall darn goat to move all morning. I'm gonna be late for the circus if I don't get my old caboose moving. You're going to the circus too? Wow, so are we. Well, uh, technically speaking, I'm uh, delivering stuff to the circus. Sawdust. Tons and tons of sawdust. Oh no! There goes my ticket to the circus. I don't have any money for a new one. Now what am I going to do? You're gonna hop right on my freight car. I'm taking you straight to the Big Top Circus in Apple Valley, Putt-Putt. I'm sure we can figure out a way to get you into that circus ticket or no ticket. Gee, thanks Cassidy. Did you hear that, Pep? We're getting a train ride to the circus. Hot ziggity! This is great! Here we are! Wow! I can't believe I'm at the circus! Yep, BJ Sweeney's genuine big top circus. And BJ's just the one you need to talk to about your little ticket problem. BJ Sweeney, the ringmaster? Wow! Where do I find him? Right next to the gate, my friend. I'm sure he'd be happier than a hen to help you out. I sure hope so. Well, thanks again for the ride, Cassidy. See you later, Cassidy. Best of luck to you, my friend. <laughs> oh my goodness! You must be BJ Sweeney, the most famous ringmaster in the world! You don't look too happy! Of course I'm not happy! I have a really big show to put on tonight! A spectacular spectacle meant to curl your tailpipe and put a spin in your tires! But I'm afraid the show can't go on! <laughs> Why not? Because everything's a jumbled mess! When we pulled in here, nothing got put in the right place. All my five main acts are crying mutiny, and the other acts are having problems too. Here are the five main acts. Honko the Clown, the Flying Porkowskis, Philippe the Flea, Reginald the Lion, and Katie Cannonball. This circus is doomed. Maybe I can help you. By the way, my name's Putt-Putt. Thanks, Putt-Putt. Here, take this. Maybe it will help. Don't worry about a thing, Mr. B.J. Sweeney. I'll do my best to make sure everything is A-OK. -okay. If you help me get this circus up and running, you'll have free circus tickets for life. That's great, since, uh, a goat kind of ate my ticket. Wow! 
Oh, I'm actually inside the big top. I should take a look around. Whoa! Has the circus started already? No, I'm early. I'm helping Mr. Sweeney to get his axe ready for the show. Hey, I could use some help. Big time. I'm Lester. Pleased to meet you. I'm Putt-Putt. What's the problem? My boss, Philippe. Philippe the Flea. He has fled with his fellow flea followers to where I do not know. He's a tad upset about the condition of his small umbrella tent here. As you can see, it's a mess. Maybe I can find him for you. Well, then you're going to need this. And see if you can find him a new tent while you're at it. Thanks, Lester. Got your peanuts. Got your fresh, hot, roasted peanuts. Mmm, that sounds good. How much are you selling your peanuts for? Usually these peanuts sell for, uh, peanuts. Less than a nickel. But today, because it's open tonight, I'm giving them away. If you take on the peanut challenge and win. The peanut challenge? What's that? Yeah, t take a closer look at my peanut gallery and I'll explain. Okay, here's how the game works. You got ten peanuts in your pile to toss to those hungry tin cars. If you can feed three cars, you will win your own jumbo bag of fresh hot roasted peanuts. On your mark, get set, throw! You did it! You won the peanut challenge! And for that astounding win, you get one jumbo bag of fresh hot roasted peanuts absolutely free from me, Bought the Peanut Cut, Home of the Peanut Challenge. One bag per customer. Wow, thanks a lot! Hey, what are you gonna do now that you won them? Gobble them up in seconds flat? No, I'm not hungry right now. I think I'll save them for later. That's a very wise decision. You might find someone you want to share them with. That must be the ring where the clown performs. That must be where the car gets shot out of the cannon. The tent is closed. I wonder what's inside. Open sesame! Here we go, Pep! This new costume looks ridiculous. It's... it's undignified. You, Reggie, could never in a million years look undignified. No way, no how, Reggie. Honest. What do you think about this travesty of a costume? It, uh, looks like you're ready to go swimming. Swimming? No, oh, of course. It's a bathing suit. Why, it's a mistake. This is coming off immediately. Good riddance. Yeah, do you have any need for this? Sure, it might come in handy. And maybe I can find your costume for you. Oh, thank goodness. Mine is a regal costume, fit for a king. Pardon me, but I don't believe you've had the pleasure. I'm Reginald Cornelius Andronicles the Third, And these are my assistants, Terry and Marie. Charmed. A pleasure. I'm Putt-Putt. Thank you for doing this, Putt-Putt. I need that costume for tonight. Yeah, without it, the show won't go on. That's a rhinoceros. They're found in Africa. That's a cockatoo. It's a beautiful bird. That's a rhinoceros. They're found in Africa. Those are giraffes. They have long necks so they can eat leaves out of trees. Those are monkeys. Monkeys are silly. 
That's a show horse. Horses like carrots. That's a camel. They can go a long time without water. Oh, hello. You come to watch Bill O'Brodnik dance? He's wild and crazy. It sure is. Oh, you take break, guys, okay? Who are you talking to? Oh, bunch of fleas. Into my fur they moved and now they are disco dancing just like Bill O'Brodnik. Wow! Mr. Sweeney said that Philippe the Flea from his flea act needed some help. Hey, I have an idea. Maybe Philippe is in your fur. I could find him and talk to him. Good. I'll help I could you too. But these fleas are very nice and polite bunch, but between you and me they are a little itch. And they make me dance this crazy disco. I need to practice my act for Big Top tonight. Well, you know what? I have the perfect thing I can use to see them and find Philippe if he's in there. Oh, very good. Okay, Bella Brodnik, let me see if I can find Philippe. Best of luck to you. Whoa! Look at all those fleas! I wonder where Philippe is. I need to find him. Philippe, are you in there? No, sorry. Is that really you? You are looking at him! I am the one and only. I suppose you have come to ask me to return to my ring in the big top? But sadly, I cannot. You see my tent? It is falling apart. Such a star like myself simply cannot work in such an inferior place. Oh, I promised Lester I would find a new tent for you, so everything's gonna be okay. So you and your flea troop can come with me, and after I find your new tent, I'll take you back to the big top. This is such a kind offer, Putt Putt. I would gladly accept, but we can only travel in style. We would need something warm, something furry, something... Oh, magnifique! I have spotted the perfect creature! Come on, everybody! It's okay, Pep. It's just for a little while. And they're very nice fleas. Oh, goodness me. Milo Brodnik says thank you very much. Now I can dance to my own beat and practice my dancing for Big Top Show tonight. I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honka the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, the Flying Porkowski's Trapeze Act, Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act, and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. What's this? Hey, it looks like half of a recipe. I think I'll hang on. Putt Putt? Baby Jumbo? How come you're not in the Car Town Zoo? I'm traveling with the circus this summer. And guess what? I'm not a scaredy elephant anymore. That's great. I learned how to paint pictures all by myself. What do you think, Putt Putt? They're really good pictures, Baby Jumbo. My mama says I have talent. I can even paint you if you want. Oh, that would be fun. All you gotta do is pick your color. 
raspberry red coming up. Hope I like this. Oh, you will. All done. Thanks. Hi, my name is Putt-Putt. I'm Sebastian the Juggling Seal. Wait, I think I've got it this time. Not again. Wow, that looks difficult. Believe it or not, right now it's harder than it looks keeping this ball in the air. Usually, I have four juggling clubs. But I do what I can. It's all I can do. Hey, if I make a fool out of myself tonight, they'll just have me perform with the clowns. Could be worse. If you want me to, I could keep on the lookout for your other juggling club. Oh, I like the way you think. That would be splendiferous. You'd be doing old Sebastian the Juggling Seal a whale of a favor. Wait, I think I've got it this time. You should see me when I have four juggling clubs. Maybe I'll get to see that. After I find your other juggling club, that is. Hey, <laughs> I can't wait. This must be where they do all the construction for the circus. I am Buzzsaw. I can cut anything with my sharp blade. Pick a shape to cut. Hmm, that machine doesn't seem to have a saw in it. I'll bet it's missing. I guess I could try to find it somewhere. Are you a real police car? Hello, Butt Butt. The name's Hank. I was a police car. Now I'm working as a security guard guarding the circus. Wow! That must be exciting. It has its good days. Sorry, you can't go back there. Or over there, for that matter. Why not? You need security clearance. Can't let just anybody backstage, you know. How do I get security clearance? Take this backstage security pass and get it authorized and signed off in triplicate by the proper authorities. Who are the proper authorities? I'm not sure, but I'll know it when I see it. All I do know is that it has to be proper. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Excuse me, Mr. Sweeney. Hank the security car said I needed an authorized signature in triplicate before he'd let me go backstage. Can you do that? Of course I can. Good to see he's doing his job. Ah, that's my life. Paperwork. Here you go. Your backstage security clearance. Thanks. Here you go, in triplicate. Look at that, BJ Sweeney's signature. Can't get any more proper than that. Go right in anytime you want to. Gee, thanks. Don't tell me Mr. BJ Sweeney sent you to talk us into performing without a safety net. 
tell him the flying Porkowskis won't do it. We refuse to fly through the air on the trapeze with the greatest of ease if we don't have a safety net. Won't do it. No way. And that's final. I wouldn't either. That would be dangerous. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt, and actually, Mr. Sweeney wanted me to help you. So, where is your safety net, anyway? That's the problem. Can't find it anywhere. It's been missing since we got here. Maybe I can find it for you before showtime. Now believe it when pigs can fly. We can fly, Paul. Well, sort of hammy. I think this platform goes all the way up to the high wire. I wonder what's up there. Here I go. Hello there. Oh, hi. Are you working at the circus? I sure am. My name's Putt-Putt. Hi, Putt-Putt. I'm Eunice. Hey, Eunice, what's that wrench for? It tightens that loose wire. I've been trying to fix it all morning. But as they say, it takes two to tighten. I think the bolt's a little rusty. Maybe I can figure out how to get over there, and then I can help you tighten it. You're on. I hope you don't think it's too bold of me to ask, but do you know a little something about music? Maybe a little bit. Why? See, I'm the circus orchestra, the circus conductor, and the circus accompaniment all rolled into one. And I've got a couple of teensy little problems. My pipes are all mixed up, and it seems like I have some old translation book stuck in them. I figure if someone can set my pipes right, I can get up enough steam to get that book out. I can help you with that. Oh, that is music to my ears. Now the key here is to arrange my pipes from the lowest note to the highest note. Okay, I'll try it. By the way, since you're being so helpful and all, I should introduce myself. I'm Bet Bandwagon. I'm Putt-Putt. Well, Putt-Putt, glad to meet you. Okay, remember, arrange my pipes so they go from the lowest sounding note to the highest sounding note. The green light means that the pipe is in the correct spot. The red light means that the pipe is in the wrong spot. I think that most of the pipes are already in the right spot. Okay, here goes. That was music to my ears. My goodness, it's the honkish translation book. Well, however did that get caught in my pipes? A honkish translation book? What's that? It's something you're going to be needing if you run into Honko the Clown. Not too many of us speak honkish around here, so this book is a must. Here. You take it, Putt-Putt, and thanks. You are my musical maestro. Thanks, Bet. This is great. So are you, Putt-Putt. So are you. Oh, 
Oh, I hope you come to help. I have. I'm Putt Putt. Mr. Sweeney asked me to help out. Oh, Putt Putt. Hello, I'm Katie Cannonball. And I'm just having the hardest old time remembering how to set my little cannon here. I fly out of it in the show, but if it's not set right, oh, there's no telling where I'd wind up. Maybe even the moon. So how do you usually set it up? Usually, I have my cannon plan. You know, a little blueprint. It shows how to set my cannon, but they seem to be missing. Do you think you could help me find them? Sure, no problem. Oh, good. Meanwhile, I'll just fiddle around with this thing. It looks like the controls have a lock on them, probably for safety reasons. I wonder how I can get to the other side. There's got to be a way. I just have to think of it. Wow! That pit sure is deep. I wonder how I can get to the other side. I don't want to waste any water. Phew! This suit is getting tight! Hey, that's Francine, the famous hippo high diver! Hi, I'm Putt-Putt! What are you doing way up there? Practicing my dive, or at least my form. The pool's as dry as the desert, so I can't jump! Why don't you put some water in it? I suspect it wouldn't do a lick of good. There's a hole the size of Apple Valley in there. It's a hole in the shape of a triangle. Maybe I can fix it for you. If you do that, Putt-Putt, you'll be my hero. I'm raring to go here. Say there, catnip. Here's a joke coming at you. Okay, hit me, Rato. <laughs> no, I meant with a joke. Sheesh, you're always clowning around. Hey, it's my job. Tell me, what do you do when you wake up in the middle of the night and you hear a rat squeaking? I have no idea. You oil it! Funny, Ratso! Wow! The clowns must use this for putting their costumes together! Wow! That must be Honko the Clown! Hi, Honko! I wonder what he's trying to say. I think I found something I can use to help me figure out what Honko is trying to say. This translation book will be perfect for talking to Honko the Clown. Huh. I wonder what he's trying to say. Let me see. Your suspenders ate scrambled eggs. I didn't think that sounded right. You missed taking a bath in bear hair. I didn't think that sounded right either. Wait a minute. I bet this is it. You're missing your nose. 
Well, if that's it, then I'll just have to find something for you that will work. <laughs> Wow, that trailer must belong to Pectoral the Strong Van. Maybe he got so strong because he eats all those fruits and vegetables. Look, a juicer. If I put some vegetables in it, I can make a vegetable shake. Hey, a trampoline! I think I'll hold on to this. It might be useful. I'm Putt-Putt. Good evening. I am Marvin the Marvelous. Prepare to be amazed, astounded, and spellbound by magical feats unlike any you've ever seen. Why bother? Everything is a mess. What's the problem? It's my magic cards. They're supposed to be in pairs, and I don't know which one goes with which. Until they're just right, I won't be able to do my famous card trick. Oh, I bet I can help you with that. That, my friend, would be simply marvelous. Thank you for this. You, I have a feeling, are about to save me. My, my magic show, my entire career. I'll do my best. I wonder which cards match up. A star. A magician's hat. Nope, those don't match. Juggling ball. A rabbit. Juggling ball. Juggling ball. All right, a match. A juggling club. A magician's hat. A magician's hat. A magician's hat. A star. A star. A rabbit. A rabbit. That's funny. There's no match for this one. I better tell Marvin about that. I'm all done. But this card was left over, Marvin. It didn't have a match. Ah, the juggling club. The match for that card got lost when we were playing Peoria. That, my friend, is all yours if you'd like it. Gee, thanks. Ah, uh ah, -uh. not so fast. You deserve much more than a mere card. After all, you saved my show. Mambo Jumbo, Hocus Pocus, Dominocus. A chicken? No, that's not right. Let's see. Abracadabra, Hocus Pocus, Dillyocus. There we go. I thought I lost my touch. A genuine juggling club. All for you. Wowie zowie! Thanks! Looks just like Mama Mobasa from the Car Town Zoo. I wonder if it is. Mama Mobasa, is that you? She sure is sleeping soundly. I wonder why she is at the circus. If I could wake her up, I could ask. I think I have something I can use to wake up Mama Mobasa. Look what I have! Fresh hot roasted peanuts! Peanuts? Am I still dreaming? This is wonderful! Why, I can't believe my old elephant eyes! Is that really you, Putt-Putt? It sure is, Mama Mobasa! Honey, it is so good to see you! Baby Jumbo and I are working with the circus this summer, and my sweet boy is having the time of his life! I already saw him, Mama Mobasa. Oh, you did? Did you see his wonderful paintings? I sure did. They were great. That's my boy. Such an imagination.
I borrowed that net from someone, but I don't remember who. I can return that for you, Mama Mubasa. BJ Sweeney asked me to help out with the circus. Whoa! This must be where Mr. Sweeney keeps all the tools to fix things for his Big Top Circus. I bet Mr. Sweeney wouldn't mind if I borrowed this saw. It might be good for fixing things around the circus, as long as I'm very careful with it. Hmm, I wonder what this is. This must be the other half of the recipe I found. Wow! I'd better hang on to it. Hmm, I wonder what this recipe makes. Pectoral the Strong Band Secret Recipe. I wonder what it could be. like the perfect place to make that power shake recipe I found. This is the place to make the power shake, all right. Hmm. Now, what is it supposed to have in it again? Pectoral the Strong Band secret recipe. Asparagus, spinach, and pears. Asparagus. Spinach. Pears. Wow, this is a powerful drink. I think I'll save the rest for later. An umbrella. This doesn't belong here. I should find who it belongs to and return it to them. In a heat, Put Put. You're welcome. Now you can be safe. The flying Porkowskis can fly again. Come on, Paul. I want to practice my flying upside down trick. Okay, Hammy, we're coming. I do hope you'll come see us in the show, Put Put. Oh, I will. I want to see Hammy do that upside down trick. It is a sight! Well, better start practicing. Oh boy! I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honko the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act, and Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night.
I think this trampoline will do the trick. Here goes nothing. Excuse me. Yes? Do you work here? I do. Hi, I'm Putt-Putt. I'm Ivan, the semi-strong van. Although right now, I'm not very strong at all. Why not? What's the matter? I can't find Pectoral's secret power shake recipe. Pectoral the strong van? Pectoral, the original strong van. When he retired, he gave me his secret recipe. And now, it's missing. Without Pectoral's power shake, I'm just the 98th found weakling. So that's what the power shake is for. I already found the recipe, and I whipped one up. Pectoral's secret power shake? You have it? I sure do. Would you like it? That is an offer I can't refuse. I whipped up Pectoro's secret power shake. Would you like it? You whipped up a power shake for me? Ivan the semi-strong van? Oh, I've been eating one of those all day. Thanks. Come to Papa. Now I feel strong. Wowie zowie. That power shake is really powerful. Okay. Watch this! That is great! Lifting a ton is easy with Pectoral's secret power shake recipe. Especially for a semi-strong van like me. Now I could do this all day, all night. Great! I got him! The plans for Katie Cannonball's Cannon Act! She'll sure be happy to see these! Okay, ready when you are. I think we got it! Great! Now if you want, you can drive across the high wire. That's what the second wire's for. It's for you four-wheelers. Me, I only need one. Gee, thanks. It looks like you're having trouble balancing. Do you think this will help? Well, it just may. Let's see. Here, you hold this little fella. That's what the problem was. Now that I think about it, that other umbrella looks awfully tiny. This is the umbrella I use in my act. I see that now. Thank you. You're welcome. What do you want me to do with this other umbrella? Keep it. I have no need for it. I can tell you that. Thanks. Well, as I always say, if at first you don't succeed, try a new umbrella.
Here's for your cannon, Katie Cannonball. I hardly know how to thank you, Putt-Putt. Uh, uh, just say thank you. Oh, thank you. Can you help me set the cannon up? Normally, I have Ivan help me out, but he's busy getting ready for tonight. I'd be happy to help you with that. Really? Oh, I am tickled. Thank you. The controls are right over there. It looks like the lock combination is six, zero, one, nine, eight, seven, six, one, yellow. Here goes nothing. I mean, a sack of potatoes. Okay, Putt-Putt, let's see how it goes. Ta-da! Perfection, Putt-Putt. Bravo! We did it! No, you did it, Putt-Putt. I don't know what I would have done without you. Well, I'd better head for the big top. I don't want to be late. I need to have plenty of time to practice my cannon act. I've got a show to put on. I'll be looking for you, Putt-Putt. See you, Katie Cannonball. Gee, I just got a kiss from a real circus star. Hey, I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honko the Clown, Philippe the Flea and his Flea Circus, and Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act. should be able to cut the pool patch for Francine now. Triangle. Hmm. I think the hole in the pool is in the shape of a triangle. Oh boy. Sebastian, one juggling club. Splendiferous. It looks just like old Sebastian the Juggling Seal's juggling club. Woohoo! That is great. Here, have a ball. Gee, thanks. 
thanks. No, gee, thanks to you. Woohoo! You did me a great favor. I'm a fantastic juggling genius once again. Arr. Lester, will this work for the flea tent? Will it ever? Put it in place and we are in business. Whoa, now that is a work of art. Philippe is gonna love it. I love it! It's even better than my first paper umbrella tent. It's magnifique! You, Pat Pat, are a star of a car. Ha <laughs> I can perform now. If you'll excuse me, I need to get ready. Sure, see you later. Philippe is coming. I am ready for my makeup. This is great. I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Honko the Clown and Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act. my dive! You got it! Okay! Pool looks full to me! Ooh! I can't wait to show off some of my fancy dives! And I can't wait to see them! Ready for a little grace in action? Well, glory be! I believe it is! No wonder this other suit is so tight! Excellent! You are a life saver! Here! I won't be needing this! Thanks! Reginald the Lion will sure be happy to get this back! Ha <laughs> ha 
Here you go, Honko. It's a little red ball. Will this do the trick? You're welcome, Honko. I was happy to help. See you in the big top. Wowie zowie. I need to help Mr. Sweeney with Reginald the Lion's Wild Cat Act. Then the Big Top Circus will be ready for opening night. Reginald. Thank you. Now, if you'll excuse me, Reginald Cornelius Andronicles the Third can go on the stage again. We've no time to waste. We have a rehearsal to attend. Thank you, Putt Putt. Yeah, you're a real pal. See you at the show. You got it. Wow! Now all the main acts are ready. Hot ziggity! <laughs> Mr. BJ Sweeney's Big Top Circus is all set to open. Welcome one and all to the opening night of the Big Top Circus. We have a really big show tonight, and we couldn't have done it without the help of a very special guest, Putt Putt. Gee, thanks! As a special thank you for all he's done for this circus, we're going to let Putt-Putt perform under the big top. Pick your pleasure, Putt-Putt. When you're done, just come up and push this button to start the rest of the show. Wow, which one should I do? You can perform in another terrific circus act, or if you're ready to start the big show, just press the red button. Wow, which one should I do? Quit? <laughs> 